Hello everyone, welcome to Real Science Challenge. I'm Kent Louie, Real Science teacher. St. Patrick's Day falls on March 17th, 2021. Today, we break down what drove all those snakes out of Ireland, and we tell you what you can do to make your world a better place. Download our free worksheet for this episode from realsciencechallenge.com to help you follow along. Let's get going. This is Real Science Challenge. When we think of St. Patrick's Day, we typically think of green, clover leaves, parades, parties, and perhaps this guy, St. Patrick, who had the power to drive out all those snakes out of Ireland. And it worked. There are no snakes that are found naturally in Ireland today. The thing that makes me go, hmm. The thing that makes me go, hmm. The thing that makes me go, hmm, is how he did it. How was St. Patrick able to make Ireland snake free? I want you to take a couple minutes and come up with two explanations for this phenomenon. Link your explanations to some of the science you already know. Discuss with your partner, but don't do a Google search. I don't want to know what Google is thinking. I want to know what you're thinking. You can draw out and label your ideas under the Illustrate Your Science section of our worksheet. Now set your timers for three minutes, pause the video, then come back afterwards when time is up. You ready? Begin. Welcome back. Now, the big reveal. It comes down to the Ice Age. Turns out there weren't ever any snakes in Ireland in the first place, because of the Ice Age. Approximately 20,000 years ago, there was an Ice Age that froze a lot of the water in the oceans. As a result, there were no bodies of water separating some of today's islands and continents. This was the case between Ireland, Britain, and France. Instead of water between these three places, land was exposed, allowing people and animals to cross between them. However, when the Ice Age started to end, the melting ice brought back the water, separating Ireland and Britain first. The water between France and Britain did not return for another couple thousand years. So, snakes migrated to this region of the world during this time. Therefore, today, snakes reside in both Britain and France, but not in Ireland. As for St. Patrick driving out all those snakes, well, that wasn't true in the literal sense. The story of St. Patrick driving out snakes is actually an analogy of how he brought Christianity to Ireland and converted non-believers represented as snakes. Now, let's make some connections between what you just heard and your prior experiences. Consider the Ice Age. Snakes and St. Patrick. What does it make you think about? For example, this makes me think about this thing I heard about in socials class because, well, fill in the blank. Write out your ideas under a connection corner of our worksheet and follow the prompts to get you started. Let's wrap this up with some direct messages from me to you. First, we need to stop introducing foreign plants and animals into our local ecosystems. This happens when people have exotic animals like snakes or exotic fish as pets. These pets sometimes escape or are set free only to start a home in the local ecosystem and threaten the local wildlife. Parts of Florida are home to pythons, which aren't a native species at all for this reason. Countries like Ireland and New Zealand have laws that prevent in individuals from having snakes as pets. So we need to do the same in our own cities, states, and provinces. We need to make sure we don't introduce any exotic pet into the local ecosystem. Second, change the world by geeking out. Do a deep dive into questions that may change the world. Who knows? Maybe you'll develop a way in which we remove invasive animal species from your local environment. It all starts by asking a question. So, what makes you go, hmm, about snakes and foreign species, and what do you want to study next? Follow the templates under question composition on our worksheet to help you get started. Thanks for watching Real Science Challenge. We have more science resources for the classroom on our website. Also, please subscribe to our channel by clicking the red button below. 
Until next time, stay safe and be real.